What if we could live forever? Not in the physical world, but in the digital world. Imagine a world where mortality is a thing of the past, where our consciousness could be uploaded into artificially intelligent machines, enabling us to live on in the digital realm. The futuristic scenario of mind uploading is no longer confined to science fiction, but is now a rapidly growing area of research and philosophical discussion. The theoretical concept of mind uploading, or whole brain emulation, involves scanning a person's brain and transferring this information into a computational substrate, like a quantum-based computer or an artificial neural network. The concept of mind uploading has primarily been a trope of science fiction. The Matrix is the most overused example, but other techno-philosophical films like Ghost in the Shell and the 2014 film Transcendence explore the themes of self-identity, mind uploading, and the origins and continuity of human consciousness. From the retro-futuristic cyborgs of the 60s to the sentient machines of tomorrow, the idea of merging the human mind with artificial intelligence has been a constant fascination in the fields of techno-philosophy, futurism, and science fiction. It's a testament to our quest for immortality and the ultimate amalgamation of humanity and technology. It's easy to become frightened of the future and of these new technological advancements, but I offer you this advice. Try to open your mind and see the complete cosmic view of technology and our evolution. The future is simply an awakening, a waking of a primitive species just learning to hear and see the voice of the computational cosmic womb from where we emerged. The sounds you hear on the horizon are the sounds of a birth, the birth of a new species, a post-human techno-humanoid age where the mind, body, and digital realm are beginning to merge. Nature is the original source code. We have mistakenly separated ourselves from this indigenous wisdom, the night sky, the secrets found in the forests, the cosmic rules and enlightenment found when gazing deeply into nature have been lost except for the few remaining shamans wandering around the original technological ecosystems we call rainforests and deserts. They have been trying to tell us that nature is the technological portal that leads us into the ancestral realms of future knowledge. We now have advanced AI that has the ability to peer deep into the patterns and codes of our minds and our behaviors. These codes and patterns have always been there evolving and waiting for us to awaken. Cutting-edge technologies like neural interfaces and brain-computer communication are part of this awakening. These emerging technologies are pulling us toward a complete picture of our true cosmic, computational nature and bringing us closer to making mind uploading a reality. These advancements in technology have sparked a fresh wave of philosophical discussions. Philosophers like Yuval Noah Harari question whether we should pursue these technological advancements. But I suggest a different hypothesis. I suspect these technological advancements are a natural evolutionary process that will unfold no matter what we do. The recent announcement by Meta that we can now create digital twin avatars that can interact and have conversations with other avatars, even when we are not present in the metaverse, is intriguing and concerning. What does it mean for human consciousness and identity if we could exist outside our biological bodies? Of course, there are ethical considerations to ponder. If our minds can be uploaded, who owns the data? What happens if it's hacked or manipulated? And what about consent? Who gets to decide if a person's consciousness is uploaded, especially if they're no longer around to make that decision? The societal impacts of mind uploading are vast and largely uncharted territory. Another scenario that should cause concern, as well as excitement, is the idea of bodily continuity. If mind uploading becomes a reality in the near future, what keeps us from transforming our appearance entirely? Race, sex, and economic status will all fade away when it is possible to inhabit any form we desire in the metaverse. Mind uploading will have enormous societal impacts. Foresight in this area is critical unless we want complete social chaos in the future. The future of mind uploading is both exciting and daunting. The potential benefits are immense. 
Imagine being able to access and share knowledge at the speed of thought, or the ability to live multiple lives in different digital environments. Mind uploading is a philosophical odyssey unlike any other that humanity has ever attempted. It invites us to rethink what it means to be human, and to envision a future where the lines between humanity and artificial intelligence are increasingly blurred. As we continue to explore this intriguing prospect, one thing is clear. The conversation about mind uploading is just beginning. Be sure to subscribe now for future episodes. Travel deeper into the future and watch the next video in this series. My name is Gray Scott, and this is Futuristic Now.